but warmth of exertion can possibly blast the pleasing prospect before us. The advance will be made in light marching order, ready for action at a moment's notice. If the enemy should be tempted to meet the army upon the march, His Excellency enjoins the troops by general order to place their principal reliance on the bayonet, that they may prove the vanity of the boast which the British make of their particular prowess in deciding battles with that weapon. The general calls upon the gentlemen officers, the brave and faithful soldiers he has the honor to command, to exert their utmost abilities in the cause of their country. By order of the commander, sir. Gentlemen, this is it. Take command of your companies and form them into column. Gentlemen, we march to Yorktown.